In other news, a 19-year-old Villanova University football player is facing charges tonight. Authorities say that he tried to sexually assault a female student inside of his dorm room in 2019. Joe Holden is live in media with the latest on this investigation. Joe? Elijah Solomon is in jail tonight, unable to post the 10% of $250,000 bail that prosecutors say a magistrate said earlier this Tuesday. Villanova Wildcats linebacker Elijah Solomon was arrested Tuesday morning on charges of attempted sexual assault, forcible compulsion, and unlawful restraint. This is a very disturbing case uh, where a football player on campus uh, tried to force another student into having oral sex with him. It was August 2019 when the accuser claimed Solomon texted her to come to his campus residence in Stanford Hall. Their court papers allege he made numerous and persistent demands for oral sex. Police say Solomon then pinned her to a bed, and when she was able to get away, he pulled her back, threw her down, and again demanded oral sex. It wasn't until police say she prayed the Our Father aloud that Solomon allegedly told her she was doing too much and then threw her against the door. She had to pray to our Lord uh, that she was going to be uh, safe. Um, he did attempt to commit a sexual assault against her. Uh, that's wrong. It's illegal. Uh, and we're going to try to hold him accountable. That's why we're bringing these charges today. District Attorney Jack Stolsteimer says the alleged victim in the case first told her resident assistant about the August 2019 incident a couple weeks after it happened. Arrest papers show at that time she did not wish to file a report. A year later, arrest papers show the university's Title IX coordinator solicited the student to file a report with the university police department, which she did. It wasn't until police say Solomon harassed her and called her demeaning names recently to people on campus that she decided to press charges. And he tried to victimize her forcefully in a sexual context in his, dorm, in, in his dorm room, uh, but then he has repeatedly victimized her by harassing her uh, and on a small campus where she happens to live where, with him. Villanova University released this statement, which I read in part, quote, Solomon has been removed from campus. There is no place for sexual misconduct of any kind on Villanova's campus or in our community. These acts constitute the deepest affront to university standards and will not be tolerated in any form. The university did add that Solomon has been indefinitely suspended from the football program. Also separately, the district attorney's office tells us they continue to investigate reported sex assault incidents from last week. They remain under investigation at this time. We're live outside the Delaware County Courthouse in media. This is Joe Holden, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Joe, thank you.